this side. Right. So after that is a bit dry, you will need a serum. It could be anyone. I'm using vitamin C serum from Dr. Rachel. Now a serum adds nutrition to the face. It also keeps the face hydrated. Serums actually have a lot of functions, particularly serums that contain vitamin C. Okay, they help in reducing redness, they help in evening out the skin tone. Some of them even have some protecting factor, okay, to help prevent your skin from being sunburned. So I would always recommend you get a serum that can help you do multiple functions aside hydrating that skin. And note, the more you feed the skin, the better results you will get at the end of your job. You have to feed that skin very well. It's like a child that you gave birth to. If you are not feeding that child properly, if you are not giving that child the needed nutrition, that child is going to be malnutrition. So just like that, you have to pamper the skin well. The more product you apply, the more you take care of that skin, is the amazing result you would get. Immediately after that, we are going to be going in with the moisturizer okay as you can already know and hear the name it is called a moisturizer for a reason it helps keep the moisture retained on that skin okay whether the person's skin is oily or it's a dry skin it needs to stay moisturized the solution to an oily skin is not to totally run away from anything liquid you know people say oh i have an oily skin so i'm not using any cream i'm not using any oils not using nothing i'll just let my skin to stay dry no the, the solution for it is to take more water and then hydrate your skin enough. And then if you have a dry skin, you know that you already need to hydrate the skin a whole lot. So whether the person's skin is dry or oily, it needs to be properly moisturized. Okay? You can see that skin glow just by doing the right skin prep. 